हेलो नमस्ते वेलकम टू ग्री टेरो सो हाव आर यू आई होप यू आर डूइंग गुड आई होप यू आर हैविंग एन अमेजिंग डे टू डे सो इफ यू आर न्यू हियर इफ यू लाइक माय कंटेंट प्लीज सपोर्ट माय चैनल बाय लाइकिंग शेयरिंग सब्सक्राइबिंग ओके सो इफ यू हैव ऑलरेडी सपोर्टेड मी थैंक यू थैंक यू सो वेरी मच सो इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स आई हैव माई इंस्टाग्राम पेज लिंक इफ यू वॉन्ट टू फॉलो मी दे गो हेड एंड गिव इट अ फॉलो and the text that i'll be using in this reading will also be listed in the description box okay so uh, let's move on to the topic so the topic for today is unexpected big changes so what unexpected big changes are coming your way so that is the topic for today as you know uh, choose intuitively if you have been attracted to any color lately go with the color or or the images okay so take a deep breath relax connect with your intuition and then choose okay so for group number 1 we have this brown color butterfly for group number 2 green and for group number 3 it's pink okay so close your eyes relax take your time pause the video if you need to pause and then choose okay so 1 2 3 The timestamps will be in the description box. So I am going to start with group number one. So hello, group number one. If you have chosen this brown color butterfly and the observation card, let's see uh, what is your message. So this is uh, the shuffling process. I'm going to shuffle on camera. Okay. So yeah. <laughs> Let's take the cards from the crystal spirits oracle cards. So let's see what big changes are coming for group number one. I feel like Archangel Raphael is with you. Some sort of healing information will be given to you guys that is going to change a lot in your life. It can be about a diet. maybe you will be scrolling through instagram page and then you will see a page where they talk about a certain diet and you will be very much interested in di that diet and you will start to do it and it will may it will be very good for you in a way something like that okay that is there some sort of healing information or maybe this is uh, for someone else in your family you you will see this page and you will give the information they will try it out and it might work out for them okay Let's see what big changes are coming for group number one. Okay, uh, I have the tea leaf cards as well, so let's shuffle that as well. So there are lots, so I'll just go half and half. So let's see. Mm. what unexpected big changes are coming for group number 1 what changes are coming for group number 1 okay we have these three cards from this set and i'm going to take another three oops so let's see Okay. One more card. Okay. So the final oracle card, wisdom of the oracle cards. Let's. Then we will start your reading. Okay. So group number one. So, uh, the first card you have chosen is observation six. Patience, attention, pause, watchful. Okay. So here the main change I feel like is happening is like you're going to be more observing of other people's actions. 
how their thoughts are affecting you for example if you have a boss okay you're working for uh, for this person uh, for like 10 years and all and then uh, whenever you uh, share some sort of like discomfort or share that i need to quit this job i want to do something different they just say that you you will never get a good job you have no talent you are just doing this daily routines and no other company will want you so they are putting that seeds of doubt inside of you right so it's like a seed is enough like sometimes some seeds have been planted inside your mind like yes you cannot have a new new job you cannot have a good job you know there are people who do, do that so i feel like this with this observation so some of you are actually observing other people's uh, behavior in a way like you will be observing yeah this person this boss always want wants me they make me do their job and i do it perfectly but at the same time they say that i don't have any skills to go out and get another job so it's like they are trying to keep me in this job for their own advantage and what is happening is like they're putting a seed of thought a seed of doubt inside me and i am actually watering that thought right so they are giving me this thought and uh, as a seed like a seed when we plant a seed uh, it grows right when we water it so here this person is giving that seed to me and what i am doing is planting it with a doubt so i'm just keeping that in mind and i'm like yes i cannot go out and i have another job because i'm not talented enough right so this is where i feel like there is a change where you're observing patterns right yes this person did that at that time maybe they want my work but at the same time they don't want to pay me right they might find excuses not to pay you enough and you what's happening is like you thought that it's your your job is not that good you're not that talented so that's why you accepted that little pay and now what is what is happening is like you're observing yes i have talents i'm very good at it but at the same time this person is putting a seed of doubt inside of me so yes so some sort of patterns are playing in your life and i feel like your spirit guides your angels are telling you to be more observant towards it so you can cut those patterns right uh yes there is a high chance that you will be discovering some sort of patterns like that it can be behavior of other people but at the same time it can be the behavior of yours as well so what kind of behavior what kind of patterns is repeating in your life like for some of you are you taking the the words of your bo boss about you very seriously how much self worth you have like sometimes because of our lack of our self worth we feel like that oh we cannot get more income or we cannot have this high high pay because our self worth is low right and this person is playing with it so here i feel like finally the hair you know the story of the hair and the toto is where he underestimated so i feel like here now the hair is like not sleeping he is actually observing this situation and he is ready to win the race right so he is not underestimating anyone he is not actually he is he is thinking like yeah i have this talent i need to use it but at the same time i don't have to underestimate anyone so his like hair is like uh, hair, hair is very uh, patiently looking at his surroundings watchful at the same time enjoying the surroundings and he and he knows that when he is uh, open when his eyes are open when he is not drifting into the sleep he will win the race right so that's something i'm getting here so here for some of you because it's like you are awake but you're asleep in a way you know sometimes we have this script of life this routine is going on our subconscious mind has a specific routine we are going to a job doing the work then coming back same old same old same old there is no change because we are not observant we are not making any change like the we are just sleeping right sleeping and just going with the script now it's the time to change the script if you have read a transurfing uh, book i feel like it talks about like uh, like uh, yeah there is a book i feel like um it's a very uh, amazing book um a uh, transurfing yeah in in that in one of his books the author uh, mentions like how we are sleeping in our daily life the, uh, the script is just playing like the like the movie script and we have the script and so so we are just playing the role and um, 
we are not even uh, we are not even seeing that patterns like we are not observant and we are just going with that so now it's the time to be more patient watchful so you can change some patterns that is not working out for you guys okay and again the signs there are a lot of signs and synchronicities that will be given to you guys so it's time to reflect on things if something is not working reflect on it if a person is acting like this just reflect on it take take a step back reflect and why this person is saying that that i'm not capable maybe they have an agenda right they want to keep me they know that i'm i'm talented so that's why they're keeping me in this company if I, I don't have any talent why they want me right so it's like it's time to take a step back be watchful understand what's happening around your surroundings what kind of patterns is happening what people are around you and then make the necessary changes okay but definitely i feel like some sort of uh, some sort of uh, like this clarity is coming your way yeah like aha moments yeah i need to do this i need to do that so be observant okay so in the coming days i feel like there will be some sort of signs that will be given to you guys that will be very clear here okay so don't sleep like the rabbit in that race as the rabbit did it's time to be watchful it's time to be present not overthinking about certain things like um if for example you uh, you're traveling somewhere what happens when we are traveling we just sleep or we are just up in our head thinking so instead of that what you need to be is to be watchful what everyone is doing what is happening what are your surroundings thing right be more watchful maybe that is a change that you need to make and when you make that change a lot of changes will follow okay so it's time to be more present yeah we have five of wands energy so yeah there is some sort of competition here happening and you are just going with the competition because you feel like you need to go for example your parents are telling yes go and do that do this corporate job or get into this medical school and and without you realizing you are in a competition and in this competition you you don't want to be in this competition but at the same time people are telling you go 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 do this do this do this right go for engineering go if, go be a doctor or do this job do that job and what is happening when we are in this competition we are not trusting ourselves we are not seeing the signs we are not observant we are just going with the script as i told there is a script written for you guys maybe your parents are telling you be a doctor be a doctor do you want to become a doctor <laughs> or are you just going are you just being used right maybe for some of you you are being used by someone right for their own advantage sometimes par parents might have a dream to become a doctor and they didn't become so maybe maybe your parents are putting their dreams on to you are they do you think that you will be happy if uh, you follow their footstep maybe they have a business they want you to follow are you are you are you ready to do that do you want to do that or you want something else or thinking about it makes you feel like up and down like should i do it should i not do it if, uh, yeah maybe your parents have a good business and you don't like that you want to do something different but at the same time they put this fear like if you do this you will not get money if you do this you will not get success so then again a doubt a seed of doubt is given to you guys and you are like yeah maybe uh, if i do this i will never get successful so let me just follow the footsteps let me just join the business right so here that's why you need to be more observant right so you be more observant pay, be patient and work on your skills rather than competing with other people be a competition to yourself change change the patterns change the things that you don't like if you are someone who is not able to work on their creative creativity right if you like like painting but you're not getting time just you know just half an hour will be enough start with half an hour and when you do that when you work on yourself when you make that half an hour for yourself you will see the changes okay so you are not here for competition that's what yeah you are here to think big plan big and you are here to travel the world that's what your spirit guides are telling you oh my god we have the death card yes so definitely there is going to be an end of a situation end of a job a toxic job 
right where this person is manipulating you into doing something that you don't like and you're just doing it because this person has given you the doubt right that you will never be able to be successful if you leave this company or if you leave this thing and if your parents like maybe for your parents like you are good for nothing you will not be able to achieve success if you don't follow this thing if you don't do this course or maybe in your relationship this person is trying to control you manipulate every uh, everything that you do like this much you have to be like this you have to change this for me and you are actually changing 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 without even realizing and you're not happy with it so right now with this death card it's like it's the time to end those patterns that's what your spirit guides are telling you right so yes definitely there is an end of a chapter a chapter where you were feeling very very competitive where you felt very up and down your energies were like up and down yeah because of this competition maybe there is a comp competitive examination that you wanted to give and uh, for some of you yes you wanted to give it uh, because you wanted to get that job or something like that and if that is the case this examination is ending this competition is ending and finally with this two of wands i feel like you're entering the next stage where you are being called for the interview or something like that yeah so that's what i'm getting here yeah so planning big for yourself is something that you need to do today plan something for yourself do you have a goal for yourself right if you have a goal write it down and work for it if you're already already pursuing your goal yes with this two of wands keep on doing because yes yes there is success your plans are going to come into fruition right for some of you you are living you are living a dream of someone else and and it's ending you will be realizing it's not your dream and that's that's the end and now the next chapter is where you're realizing what you actually want to do and you're going forward so that can be a big change happening in your life but but some sort of toxic people are leaving your life or maybe if they had hold on you as i told this give you a thought a seed of doubt and you you water it and that's why it becomes big right like you water the seed with your doubt and you doubt and doubt and that's why you are staying there now what's happening is even though give you they even though they give you that seed you're not taking it you know that because you are observing your observation skills are good and you know that what this person is trying to do so you're not taking it right so that's the big change you're becoming more observant uh your surroundings you're looking you're very observing and you're seeing ah yeah this person is doing this right now so i don't have to take this yes this person is, is might be insulting me because they have issues it's not me right you are understanding that here yeah so i feel like you are becoming more confident yes so the confidence level is increasing i feel like that okay so yes it's like it's a it's a beginning of a new you in a way you're releasing the old patterns you're releasing the old behaviors that is not helping you anyway you're actually even releasing the the conflicts that other people has given to you like with this five of wands someone has put you into a competition that you didn't want to be a part of and finally you're getting out of that thing that's what i'm getting here yes and look with this two of wands she has the world in her hands and now she is like yes it's like your heart is in your hands now you know what your heart wants wants you to do so you are just actually listening to your own heart rather than other people so that's the change here uh we have the jade here and we have the number 27 number 27 again 27 reduces to number 9 and 9 is also about completion right completion of a chapter beginning of a new chapter here and yes your consciousness is changing yes if from um if you had this uh, lack mentality like for one 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 big change is that you didn't believe in yourself as i told someone has given you the doubt 
and you only watered that doubt so you didn't believe in yourself you didn't see, didn't see the treasures that you had within yourself now you're becoming observant and now you're like yes i have this skill i used to enjoy this uh, hobby during my childhood let me continue to continue to do this yes i'm good at marketing i'm good at sales but why this uh, but this job uh, this uh, my my boss is telling me that i'm not good i'm doing enough i'm doing amazing right so it's like uh, because of other people you didn't realize that you had so much treasure inside of you you had so much talent but because they wanted your gifts right they wanted your talents for their their own advantage they told you that you're not worthy enough you're not good enough and you thought that you're not but that's the thing is ending now you're realizing your own treasure your consciousness is like grow, like expanding you're realizing yeah i have this talent i can make it happen i can make anything happen so that's the change here inside you this change is happening yeah so don't doubt yourself it's it's the other people that has given you that that doubt and you will be recognizing that you're more than enough you can do anything you can accomplish anything if i want to accomplish anything i will that's that's what i have been doing in this company i have been doing that but then also this boss will tell me that i'm not good enough that i have to work harder it's for their own advantage right that's what you're realizing and that's that's breaking the pattern so yes for some of you i can see that you will be leaving this company and doing something that you actually love because your self worth is increasing you're believing in yourself in your treasures you're recognizing that you're more than enough right so yeah that's nice you're choosing yourself and that's the change oh we have secret admirer maybe this boss of yours just example like this person who tells you that you're not good enough maybe they ad- admire your skill secretly <laughs> yeah maybe they do that and that's why you need to be more observing you need to observe your surroundings you need to observe what this person is trying to say what they are they manipulating you right into thinking that you are not good enough so i feel like for many of you there might have been people around you who might have told you you're not good enough and you might have actually believed in them and you might have done everything for them and you didn't get, get anything in return like a job where you're giving a lot but you're not getting anything back your pay is very less so now your standards are high because you are recognizing yourself so here next time i feel like you will be asking for a raise in pay otherwise i'm leaving this job because you know that you can get any other job so that's what i'm getting here love Oh for some of you there is a new person entering your life maybe this uh, through this person you will be recognizing your talents like this person will say oh you you do this thing very nicely oh you're so good at it maybe no one has told you that before right and then you're like yes i'm good at it but no one said that to me <laughs> right so that's why there you are observing things like yeah this pattern is happening yeah you're loving yourself more so maybe for some of you there will be someone who will be pointing out your gifts your talents and then you will be recognizing yes no one said that to me before everyone told me that i'm not good enough and this is the first person who is telling me that i am i'm doing good like i have this talent like a stranger will say something like that and you will be like yes i'm good at it I, I love this thing. I do this with my full heart, and I'm so amazing at it. But there were people who were not so happy with that, so they put this seed of doubt, and that's what is changing here. Wow! Look, we have great happiness. So yes, you are loving yourself. It's like it's the time where you're taking care of yourself. For some of you, I feel like this is a message your spirit guides are telling you to start admiring yourself. start admiring the talents you have because you're very talented and i feel like all your all your life you have been manipulated into thinking that you were not good enough so you felt like you need to do more 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 and you might have not not followed your dreams now is the time to follow your dreams because you can achieve anything you desire okay group number 1 that is the message with love you can achieve anything so so first you need to practice self love take care of yourself this is like a new bloom that is coming with this death card the old old person has entered this is the new one 
who has a lot of self-worth, right? Who believes in themselves, who recognize their own power. Yeah, oh look, someone is behaving stupidly. So I feel like that. You will be recognizing that who this person is by your observation skills. Like your observation skills are heightening. And with this financial pinch, what I'm getting like this person used to say that, um, oh again with this law also, maybe they, this person told you that you have to give me this money, otherwise you cannot leave, the, leave this job. Maybe they try to manipulate you. They cannot do anything to you. They're just behaving stupidly. Nothing is going, going to happen. You don't have to worry, right? So that's one thing. You need to be more observing. Like when this person is saying all these things, just be observant. What is this person trying to do? And look at the facts and all, this person cannot do anything. Even if they're taking you to court or anything like that, you're going to win for sure okay so yes and if there has been any court issues i feel like you are getting your justice that is something i'm seeing here if someone has uh, played with your money maybe there has been like maybe you were, you were not paid for your work uh, they were not you know some some people take maybe they take your service and they are not paying you back and they are acting stupid that they didn't get that much service that your service was not good and all and if that is the case and if there is a court issue i feel like you will get the justice <laughs> okay so that's something i'm seeing here yeah and if there is in your relationship this is happening this person is manipulating you stopping you from growing right making you feel like that you're good for nothing i feel like there is this end for this as well because you are actually realizing your own treasures it's like you're observing your own treasure yes i'm good at it I can do this. I have been managing everything so well. So why this person is telling me that I'm not good? And then you're thinking about it. And then you're realizing, yes, this person wants a hold on me. This, wants, this person wants power on me. And they want their things to be done by me. And now I'm like, I don't have to do their things. I have to do my things first. It's like you're choosing yourself and you're recognizing your own treasure. Like the earth is in her hands, the world is in our hands and now she knows what she needs to do, where she needs to go. Yeah, because she was with these people, she was so lost. She or he, gender doesn't matter. Now it's like she's rising like a phoenix and she knows that, yes, I know where I need to go. I know what I want to do. No one can stop me. No one can stop me from my own happiness. I'm going to, because I'm going to choose myself. I was not choosing myself. I was choosing other people. I was choosing uh, their work over my well-being. Now I'm not going to do that. I'm going to choose my well-being over their work. Right? Yeah. Oh, wow. I like up. Again, with this I told you a secret admirer or a love and with this leg up I feel like someone around you maybe this is a new person who's entering your life and making you realize that how much you do how capable you are and then you're like yeah no one has ever said this to me and this person is saying it maybe they have seen something that I'm not seeing about myself because no one said that and that that will put you in a thought and you will be observing things and then you're like, yeah, yeah, I do have skills. <laughs> so that's something I'm getting here. For some of you, this is like a message from spirit that you will be receiving. And you will be like, yeah, I can do that. Or maybe it's like your mothers, you're becoming new, um, you bec you're, a, you're, a, you're a mother and you have like your, your five year old or six year old or, or your child is telling you, mom, you are so talented. Why don't you do that? And you're like, yeah. Let me do that. Like your child will show you something that you haven't seen about yourself. And that is going to change a lot of things because you will be believing in yourself. So yes, there is someone around you. It can be a stranger. It can be an uh, admirer. Maybe they admire your skills in your workplace. Maybe they admire your skills and they're telling you, oh my God, you're so awesome. And you're like, yeah, am I awesome? And then you will start thinking and you will be like, yes, I have so much talent. Why I thought that I was not capable and that is going to change a lot, lot. That will change a lot of things in your life. And this is the start of the change. The start of the change is inside of you where you are actually seeing yourself from a different eye. You're actually understanding your own treasures and um, that will lead to a lot of happiness 
in your life okay so and again a new new person or maybe a maybe for some of you a new child is entering your life so it's like end of a chapter a beginning of a new phase maybe for some of you i'm even getting you will get the custody of your child if there is some issues with that um there will be um there will be balance there yeah so whatever if if there is some sort of imbalance i feel like there is balance coming and it will lead to great happiness so maybe for some of you with this love as well maybe there has been some sort of issues in your marriage regarding the finances maybe this person has done something uh, financially maybe they have taken your money from you without you realizing uh, and uh, if there is a court case for that thing there is justice coming and you will get that happiness that you deserve okay so that's all i have for group number 1 hope it resonated hope it gave you the clarity i will see you soon bye bye So group number 2 if you have chosen this green color butterfly let's see what big changes are coming your way Okay so I'm going to shuffle first and then we will start the reading So okay So yeah this is the acknowledgement card that you have chosen let's start from the tarot deck This is the tarot of mystical moments let's just shuffle and see what's what big changes are coming for group number 2 okay okay i feel like you're actually healing something something from your past okay you're actually crossing the bridge you were in the middle of the bridge now you're crossing the bridge okay so there is a successful outcome of a problem okay so that is the change where you will get the solution to a problem okay let's see what else i'm seeing mountain so yes there has been obstacles in your life but you will be able to overcome it you're getting the strength to overcome it okay So let's take uh, the the oracle cards from the crystal spirit oracle deck. Okay, let's see what messages for you guys. What big changes are coming? The group number two. Okay, so this is the card. Then. we have the steel leaf oracle cards that i will be pulling out from so there are a lot so let's just take okay oh you got a month maybe this is important okay so we'll, we'll keep it that way okay let's see what big changes are coming for group number 2 oh you got another month <laughs> oh god maybe for some of you you're very much uh, into timing like when this will happen when this will happen <laughs> maybe that's why spirit guides are giving you time like months when this will happen okay let's see okay so you have a lot i get thing <laughs> So let's see from the final oracle deck. This is the wisdom of the oracle. Let's see what is the big change coming your way. Okay. So these are your cards. Let's see. Okay, so we have this card 26 acknowledgement seeing knowing acceptance. Okay, acknowledgement. So I feel for many of you you are going to acknowledge that your intuition was on point for some of you uh, i feel like you will be realizing that yes you have this clairvoyant abilities clair cognizance abilities you will be like yeah i saw that and it happened so yes i have this ability so if you were like i don't have any psychic abilities if you were feeling like that i feel like your doubts are going to be very very uh, your doubts will be cleared and you will be realizing yes that you are very intuitive you are very psychic uh, so yeah so if you have any doubt regarding that here are 
owls animal spirit is here to come and tell you that you are very 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 intuitive okay you are very intuitive person for some of you your life path number might be six not not necessary but six i'm getting the six number and maybe number two as well or number eight as well um so we have seen knowing acceptance so some of you here are clairvoyant some of you are claircognizance okay so these two gifts are very strong for you guys uh, for some of you you might not be able to hear your intuition very clearly in the in the past maybe for some days you ha have you had this blockage if there was this blockage it's going to unblock okay and yes you are someone who can see in the dark you can see what others are not seeing through their naked eyes because your third eye is open you can see very clearly so you are someone who can see the truth very very clearly okay so that's something i'm getting here so yeah that there is a change um, my if i'm getting the change is like your psychic abilities is going to be very very heightened you can you will feel the guidance very very clearly if you are asking for any signs you will get it very quickly so yes the connection uh, with the spirit realm is it's very strong that's one thing i'm getting here okay and if you're someone who is feeling like you need to uh, start doing a night job or something like that if you're interested in it uh, go ahead so maybe there is a shift there also change uh, maybe from a night uh, from a day job you're going to do something uh, in night uh, that is also something i am getting here okay and yes you can do very well at night you you are you're not going to be someone who, is, who will feel very sleepy you will be very awake so yeah that is also there and for uh, some of uh, uh, some of you who are some if you are tarot readers or if you, if you do some sort of spiritual things and all i feel like uh, people will be acknowledging your work recognizing your work okay so you're going to get that recognition that you deserve even if you're not in that field i feel like there is some sort of acceptance recognition coming your way okay maybe this is a uh, acceptance from your family maybe they didn't like the job you do finally you're getting that acceptance from your family yeah so if there was some sort of issues with your family i feel like that is also going to be resolved you're getting that getting that acceptance yeah okay and for others i feel like you're accepting that you have the psychic ability and maybe you are like interested in learning about it so you are going to accept it and move forward with it that is also there and what you know guys here your spirit guides are telling you know something about yourself you know what to do go ahead with it because it's truth okay yeah sometimes people cannot see things from their naked eyes even though they see things it might it might not be the truth but when we see from the third eye it's the truth so you are seeing the truth so acknowledge it and move forward with it okay if your intuition is saying something just do for, do it that's what the message is it will lead to a lot of abundance we have justice we have six of cups oh something that was not justified in the past is going to get justified as i told maybe in the past you might not have been recognized for your skills for your talents for your intuitive abilities but finally you're getting the justice you're getting the balance or maybe you were doing something maybe you're an intuitive you're a medium you used to give readings and all but people didn't recognize it people didn't give you that much value if that is the thing i feel like you're you're getting what you deserve you're being recognized you're getting that equality you're getting that balance okay and we have four of wands so some sort of celebration is get, coming your way with this four of wands so some maybe for some of you this is the work that you might have done in the past but at that time you didn't get that um, that rewards now you're getting that reward so you're going to celebrate it so something that you have worked you have worked for this very hard in the past and you didn't get the justice at that time you didn't get that much what you deserve and now you're getting it okay so this can be an equal relationship as well for some of you going to because we have this justice and four of wands so some of you are getting married i have to say that that can be the big change maybe this is a person that you know from the past or maybe this is your soulmate that you are getting married to 
for some of you it can be a court marriage and then you will celebrate in your home look at it we have this justice so six of cups and four of wands so it's like someone some of you are uh, uh, meeting your soulmate or you know this person uh, yeah, it's like you know this person, you know this person for a very long time. At that time, they didn't commit, but now they are committing, they are proposing you. So first you have this court marriage and then you celebrate at night. <laughs> you might uh, call, uh, call all your family members, friends and then celebrate and dance. For some of you, this is about a home, a house, maybe something that you were dreaming in the past. At, at, in the past, it didn't happen. Maybe there were some issues regarding the documents and all. That issue is going to be very, very cleared. And now you are celebrating because you are able to buy a new home, right? So that's something I'm getting here for. So the main change is something that was not justified in the past is going to get justified and you are going to celebrate that. It can be about a home, some sort of documents that were not uh, cleared, uh, some issues with legal, some legal problems, some legal issues. Uh, if there was there, um, maybe you had missed some documents, you didn't have certain documents, that's why it was not cleared. But finally things will be cleared for you guys. And uh, yes, there is celebration happening. And one more scenario I'm getting like, uh, maybe in your, in your, um, life uh, maybe your sister or your brother uh, had a love relationship and when this person came uh, your intuition told that this person is not right for your brother or your sister because you felt that something is off with this person because your intuition is very very strong but uh, but but other people other people couldn't see that because this person was very charming very kind you know this person was wearing a mask but not everyone can see that right so at that time people complain uh, com complain told you that you are uh, just jealous or something like that they they told you you've uh, you are just saying it you don't have any proof maybe they doubted you and uh, i feel that truth is also coming out your family members or the people who thought that you are just lying um, they will they will see the truth very clearly that this person was actually not good for them good match for them and uh, yes if there has been some issues in the relationship uh, because of a third party as I told you uh, your brother or sister had this person and you didn't like them and they just thought that you're jealous or something like that uh, they will understand why you said that and they will acknowledge that that you were right and that's why there is balance so if there was a relationship issue i feel like in the past if there was some sort of relationship issue uh, that will be resolved and you are coming together okay this can be in your relationship as well maybe maybe this was your spouse friend and you felt off you said something and uh, your spouse didn't like it and because of it your relationship had a rough 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 patch like it has to go to a rough patch or something like that and now your uh, spouse will understand what you meant because he will be seeing from his eyes right or from his or her eyes and this will lead to you two coming together and they will ask for forgiveness and of course i'm going i'm feeling like you're going to forgive so yes this can be any scenario but and for others it's like with this childhood maybe you had a dream in your childhood that you were not able to accomplish because of the problems that uh, adulthood brought in your life now you're going back to that uh, that um, that uh, hobby and this hobby or this work that you're doing that you used to enjoy doing in your childhood uh, it will bring a lot of happiness in your life it will bring a lot of uh, balance in your life that's something i'm getting here for some of you a very balanced relationship is coming your way um, for some of you as i told if there was some issues in the relationship that is getting better and you're celebrating some of you are buying new home that is a change um, for some of you, if there has been legal issues, you're getting the win uh, and you're celebrating that. But whatever this is, you're getting the justice because we have the four of wands, so you're going to celebrate that. So things are getting in the balance. If something was out of balance in the past, it's getting balanced. It can be about your work, love, money, anything. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so we have Lepidolite. So here spirit is telling you to uh, organize things, okay? So one task at a time. You need to balance your energies as well. So uh, 
it's like for some of you as i told uh, again the purple color the crown chakra is very much open for you guys right so you're receiving a lot of a uh, lot of messages so you uh, so you're doing one task and then you are receiving a message so so you're like oh let me do this task i have this idea so you're leaving this task for an another task right don't do that so complete one task and then go for another task so if you are someone who is buying a new home right and you have so much to do in this new home because we have to organize things so what you need to do is uh, don't get overwhelmed by that just complete your living room first then only move to the bedroom right first organize your living room completely and then move on to the next one so there's there is an issue here for you guys the issue is like overwhelm because there is a lot to do and you don't know where to start from so start from a small thing and complete them and then move on to the next thing so organization is very much needed okay um in the case of emotions as well you know uh, with this crown chakra opening you're receiving lot of ideas so write down your ideas and start from one just complete that thing and move on to the next one i have seen a video where there was a uh, three balls in one ball there were peanuts in the second ball there were almonds and the third one uh, third was uh, like um, uh, cashew nuts right and what happens is they will take a ball and mix all these three balls and um, um yeah something they mix and uh, they they see an experiment how much time it will take to put uh, you know differentiate these three things Uh, like, like um, yeah, three balls are there. Uh, everything is mixed, so we have to put, uh, take it from this ball and uh, keep it. Like one ball, we have to keep the almonds. The second ball, cashew nuts, and the third, third ball, uh, what was <laughs> walnuts or whatever it is, right? So, uh, so when we were just focusing on one thing, like f uh, f if you are just focusing on the walnuts and keeping the walnuts first. and then second we will focus on the cashew nut and then keep the cashew nut uh, then at the end uh, there will be only the left and then we have don't don't have we don't have to sort right so 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 when we the main thing is like i have <laughs> the main thing i i'm uh, i'm getting from here like i'm trying to tell you guys is that just focus on one thing when you focus on one thing and work on that then it will take less lesser time when you focus on two or three time three things at the same time because at that experiment when a person was focusing on all the thing uh, they took more time and when they just focused on one thing it was very much less less it took only less time yeah i'm sorry if i haven't uh, uh, said that very well but that was the that the, that's the thing right so if we fo the main thing is like i'm sorry for this the main thing is when we focus on one thing it we can finish it very quickly it will not take a lot of time but when we are focusing on two or more than two things at the same time we will get overwhelmed and at the same time it will be very much time consuming as well okay so with this lepidolite you need to focus on one idea work on that that idea and after finishing that idea you can go to the next idea okay so yeah you don't have to understand everything in one day you don't have to do everything in one day these changes a lot of changes are coming your way um it, maybe for some of you it's about your finances you're receiving a lot of money right and you don't know where to invest so so start doing something uh start learning something about money then do the next step then do the next step okay so yes go slow go slow that's what i'm getting otherwise you will be very much overwhelmed so that's yeah that's this is something i'm seeing a lot of overwhelm energy for you guys but just do one task at a time and i'm sorry i i i i i was not able to say it very well <laughs> sorry for that okay so yeah let's see what the tea leaves have to add oh we have a stubborn aggressive person that is moving out of your life i feel like this you could see like there i i seriously feel this person was very aggressive but they didn't show that to other people you could see it very very clearly through your <laughs> through your intuition right and now this person's uh, true identity is coming out that's something i'm getting and you're getting the justice look we have position of authority yes so maybe for some of you it's like you were um, 
as I told in your family, because of this person, there was some sort of chaos. No one believed in you that this person was not right. You felt something off, but this person had a charm and uh, this person fooled everyone, but you were not fooled. Uh, but finally, their truth is coming out and everyone can, everyone can see that truth very clearly and you're getting that authority, you're getting that position. Okay, So that's something I'm getting. You're getting uh, what you deserve. What you have been working hard for, you're getting it. Maybe someone was trying to take that away from you, uh, but you're getting it anyway because their truth is out. January month might be significant for you guys, maybe buying home or some sort of, yeah, maybe if you have some issues uh, legally with this person, truth, truth is coming out. So January might be a month where you're getting that position. Maybe someone tried to take your position. You're getting it back. So yeah, yeah. Uh, period of frustration lessons to be learned so yeah this is what is ending I feel like maybe because of this person you had to uh, go through this period of frustration but at the end you learned the lesson uh, maybe you have learned something so if you have learned a lesson keep it with you and uh, um, use it whenever you need okay because you learn something and of course we all learn from mistakes so you don't have to repeat that uh, but you are out of this maybe because of this person you had to face some sort of uh, problems as i told because they were showing them in this kind manner by wearing a mask but you could see it very clearly but you were not able to prove it but everything is coming out in out yeah everything the truth is coming out with this owl as well the truth is out everyone can see that yeah, someone you know is undependable and insincere. Yes, you you know knew it in your heart. Your intuition knew it, but finally everything is clear. Everyone can see it very very clearly, as I mentioned that. And because of it, uh, the relationship that you had with your people is blossoming because this person is leaving your life. Yeah. Yeah. Oh wow, we have solid foundation. Success with effort. Again, I'm getting this uh, house. Uh, building your your house okay maybe uh, during this building of your house there was someone who was trying to take your money off and you knew it but at the same time your husband or your wife didn't uh, believe in you then ev then everything came into light now finally you have learned the lesson your spouse or your family members have learned the lesson now the foundation is strong now there is no lies only truth and now you're going to move forward Okay, that's what I'm getting again with this four of wands energy with this tower. Now no one can shake you. Now no one can take your um, success from you. You're going to be justified. We have October month as well. So, oh wow. So October month, maybe next month is going to be very significant for you guys. You will see the changes. Uh, yeah, if there has been some blockages regarding your uh, papers and all, there will be some sort of a movement in the month of October. Um, yeah. Uh, with, again with this don't try to do everything by yourself don't don't try to do five six tasks by yourself just organization is very much important for you guys if you're getting a lot of ideas organize one by one one step at a time that is very much important here no place like, like home again home so maybe something related with your home is getting balanced if there has been issues in your inside your home it's going to get balanced if there was some patterns that was round and round and round in your home that is going to end and things are getting better and better and better so your home life is getting very much good that's what i'm getting yeah if there has been chaos in your home life that is going to end if there has been problem, if you, were, if you were constructing your home and there has been issues while this construction was happening, that is going to end, right? Mm. Yeah, if there was someone who is cheating, like maybe you were constructing your home and they were taking your money away, you will know it and they will not be able to do that anymore. Everyone will see that, okay? Uh, and yes, uh, your confidence is building up. You're believing in your intuition. You're believing in your inner light. That is also something is changing. But as you're believing in your in your inner light, you're receiving a lot of messages. So, so organization is very much important. Yeah. Okay. So that's all I received for you guys today. Hope it made sense. I will see you soon. Bye bye.
group number three if you have chosen the pink color or butterfly let's see what big changes are coming your way we have the solitude card for you guys i'll be shuffling and then we will be leaving the cards so let's see what big changes are coming for group number three what big changes are coming for group number three so maybe there is a completion of a uh, project and because this project is completed now you can rest so yes there is a change there where you can go and take a break for some of you this can be travel where you are able to take a break from work that can be a change okay uh, yeah let's see what's happening for you guys so Oh, justice came for group number two as well. You also have. <laughs> okay. From the crystal spirits oracle, let's see what is the message. Let's shuffle that card. Okay. <laughs> Let's just take one card, okay? Okay, we got this one. So next is the tea leaf cards. So there are a lot. So let's see what the tea leaves card have for you guys. I'll be taking three cards from each. We got one. Okay. Oh, you got an extra four. Let's take that. Okay. So, for group number three, what big changes are coming? Changes are coming. Big changes are coming. Oh, you got a month as well, September. Hmm. Oh, yeah, September. When I'm posting this, it will be the month of September. So, maybe this month is going to be significant for you guys. Some sort of changes might be happening this week. Maybe this break that you're going to take will be in this month. Okay, so that is also there. So, let's see. The final. This is the wisdom of the oracle cards then we will start our reading okay yeah. i feel like september month is going to be amazing for you guys group number three okay so we have the 11 numbers solitude rest ponder quiet sanctuary so for some of you you might be taking a break from your work for higher studies that is the case okay so yeah if you have a plan to take a break from work and go for higher studies this is going to happen okay that that's sure i feel like that maybe you want to go to a different country where you can study and uh, yes you will be able to do it and uh, in this in this place where you will be alone you will be able to learn a lot of new things that will be very good okay again i will you will be able to gain a lot of wisdom that's something i'm seeing here so for some of you this is a uh, energy of hermit with the solitude where you are alone not with many people right so if you are someone who who stays with a lot of people i feel like you will be staying alone for some time there is the change yeah that is the change like if you're staying with your family now you're getting you are planning to go abroad for higher studies so you're going there you're staying alone so yes that's something i'm getting here for others this is like you are you are going through a major spiritual awakening where you are actually asking your soul what you want and um, you're working on it maybe you will be reading a lot you will be researching a lot yes 
rather than going to parties i feel like you will be sitting with yourself researching learning reading or going by like going by yourself to a trip a solo trip that is also quite possible for some of you so yes it's like you're working on your well-being you're working on yourself so if you have gone through a, a dark period you're actually healing from that and you're realizing a lot of things that you need to change in yourself and you're working on it but this is a quiet time where you're not going to party a lot you're just sitting with yourself reading a lot of things gaining a lot of wisdom so that is the change here spending time with quality time with yourself taking care of yourself learning the things that you want to learn gaining a lot of wisdom gaining a lot of knowledge it's like uh, you're getting very disciplined with your life self discipline uh, taking your life uh, seriously at the same time having fun right yeah um for some of you you are only going to focus on a goal that you want so that's why you want uh, that uh, free time uh, you you need to let go of the other people's energy because sometimes when other people are in our life we are not able to focus that much so i feel like you will be having your me time you will be making time for yourself like in one day at least 3 to 4 hours or 5 hours will be your own time where you will where you will be researching reading learning doing the things that you want to do working on your craft working on your career working on your finances working on your goals that's what i see but you're going to learn a lot of wisdom you're go going to get a lot of wisdom not learn so yeah that's what i'm getting yes this is a new beginning for many of you maybe for some of you new new course you're going to learn as i told going abroad all by yourself you don't know where, what you're going to do mm, so that is a change a big change here that is you're going to do everything by yourself like uh, you are a person for the first time in your life you're going to do that travel alone and you're going to stay by yourself and it's a very risky thing you're doing but you will be happy you will be understanding a lot of things in this journey like the fool is the start of a journey right and in the start of a journey you're going to learn a lot of things you're going to gain a lot of wisdom right and you will get that experience that you need right so yes that's what i'm getting interestingly with the solitude card i'm getting the hermit energy and here we have nine hermit energy if we see is like the nine number it's a completion of a cycle and then we have the zero number so zero is the start of a journey so it's like you have learned something now you're going for higher studies like a chapter has ended now this is a new thing you don't know about it you don't know anything about it you're just like the crocodile is there you don't know where you're going but at the same time you're taking a leap of faith and you're going to enjoy it and you will be all by yourself that's the thing oh we have justice okay so yes now you don't have to worry about it uh yeah with this four of cups i feel like right now this is your energy with this four of cups you're feeling a little bored uh maybe you want to do something in your life maybe you have a goal that is not moving forward yes this is it. maybe right now you want to travel somewhere <laughs> maybe you want to go for higher studies maybe you want to uh travel in your maybe you're seeking jobs in a different country but right now you're not seeing that thing maybe there are visa problems some sort of issues are there so but this four of cups energy is going to end because look there is this umbrella look she, you're so protected right so if something is not manifesting right now if you have this plan to go abroad and start this new thing uh, don't worry this will happen you're very protected at the correct time it will it, this change is going to happen so don't worry guys don't worry with this four of cups yeah right now maybe for some of you you're seeking a job and it's not happening maybe you're seeking a relationship it's not happening maybe you want to uh, move to a new country it's not happening maybe you want to uh want to solo travel it's not happening 
right so something is not happening and you're feeling like why 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 this is not happening and here universe is showing you a new direction a new journey uh, so if I, I seriously feel some of your dreams are definitely going to come true uh, a new journey is coming your way a new pathway is coming your way you will be feeling very justified but maybe you wanted to go to this place maybe you'll not be going to this place you will be going to a different place a different country that is also quite possible so what you what you're thinking like if you have a plan for your you guys it will not go the way you want it will be in a different way but you are going to get your wish come true in a different way and you will be like yeah this was the best thing universe gave me the best thing so something like that is coming here because we have the justice and the fool so this risk that you will be taking i feel like a risk you will be taking you will be taking a leap of faith and this leap of faith that you're taking the you know you're jumping into the unknown you don't know where you're going right you're going alone you're all by yourself you have to do things by yourself right and um, with this justice card here everything will be justified yes your decision will be balanced you will be like yes i took the best decision uh, i d even i didn't know where i was going but i took it i took this leap of faith and i'm happy right like for some of you you are called to uh, open a youtube channel and you're working from home all by yourself and uh, maybe you never thought that you will start a youtube channel because you want to do do something else but at that point you felt like you need to start this so you start researching about it you do the work you do it all by yourself and then this youtube channel you you don't know where you're going where it's going to go if will you get the subscribers will will you make money you don't know anything about it anyways you're jumping into it you're starting a youtube channel you're working on it by yourself some days will be days where you will be feeling very bored you will be feeling like you're not moving forward there will be days of uh, giving up there will be days where you will be feeling like why i started this it's it's so lonely uh, i shouldn't have done it i should have gone for a nine to five job then then also you will persist and what will happen is like you will get the justice <laughs> that's that's what is it okay so yes and your youtube will work right so it's like you're jumping into the unknown you don't know where this journey is taking you but you're in this journey you will be like the fool fool doesn't know anything they're just jumping they're just jumping they don't have anything they're not carrying their past baggages as as well but in this journey they are going to learn so much with the solitude energy they will learn how to do things like when you start a business you don't know about anything right but as you work on it you will learn so many things and you know what to do what not to do some days will be boring some days will be like why i started this but at the end you will get the justice you will you will have that balance okay and you will gain a lot of information kinite okay so maybe for some of you uh, the problem is right now um, maybe you want to go for higher studies or maybe you want to start a business or maybe you want to do something but there are objection uh, objections right people are not people have different perspective like you're not like yeah everyone doesn't have the same perspective everyone has different perspective that maybe they are telling you do 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 this don't do that don't do start youtube channel go for a 9 to 5 job and you're feeling like you need to start a youtube channel mm, so there is like this conflict if there has been conflict right now and that's why you're feeling in this four of cups energy because no one is listening to me nothing is happening i have i i don't want to do what they're telling me but finally i feel like with this kinet the conflicts that is going on is going to be resolved people will understand you and the perspective is going to change so it's like in meetings uh, if you are someone who is a business person and there is meeting and you have this idea but no one is uh, is saying that they like this idea they're objecting to this idea and uh, i feel like uh, if there has been that kind of objections if there there has been some sort of conflicts i feel like there is peace there is balance coming so yes people are going to accept it that's something i'm seeing here okay yeah that's a good thing then we have tear drops yeah again four of cups so there has been some sort of conflicts right now in your life something that you wanted is not uh, coming true uh feeling like giving up crying yeah that's going to change there are some conflicts because people are not wanting you to do that thing maybe they are not approving of your ideas so you feel like rejected 
you feel like no one understands you but don't worry this is going to end okay this is going to change oh in the month of september i feel like yeah this will change the month of september is going to be good for you guys this four of cups energy is going to go and understand if this uh, this conflict maybe for some of you this conflict was for a reason maybe divine was protecting you maybe it was not the correct time right uh, sometimes timing matters uh, but in the month of september you are going to see that uh, the conflicts that you had in your life is definitely improving okay so yeah we have get back to the basics uh, so yes i feel like it's like uh, there was an idea that you presented people didn't like it so you stopped doing it now people will be like yeah let's start do it you do it there maybe you're getting the permission to do something like that it's like you have been trying to go to a country the visa didn't happen some sort of conflicts arise now uh, things are improving right now you have to get to back basics now you have to start doing that all things preparations and all so yes that's that's what is this like yeah chain of events that will affect your life so yes it's going to happen one by one 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 by one so one thing is going to like first the conflict will be gone right things will improve then the next thing will happen then you will have to travel so you have to pack bags then next thing you have to go you have to go there you have to live by yourself so yes so so yeah i feel like with this four of cups this person is not doing anything not interested now they have to jump and start doing all the things from the start okay so yeah that's what i'm getting here yeah look we have heart love deep affection and caring so with this great personal sorrow your heart has been broken now your heart is healing so yes uh, you're releasing the past now this is a new journey here so maybe for some of you a thing didn't happen but the next thing is happening like maybe you you applied for a specific university and you didn't get the admission now you're getting some sort of um, uh opportunity from somewhere else now you're like yeah i need to get back to the basics i need to do this i need to do that and now your heart is filled with love and joy and you're happy <laughs> right look uh yeah empty someone is leaving your life so this conflicts i feel like the conflict or maybe a person who was creating this conflict was uh, is out of your life so that's why uh things are getting better right so maybe for some of you uh, maybe a person who created this conflict is getting out of your life right or maybe this conflict is out of your life the situation is out of your life and now you are getting back you're ready to go to the unknown yes that's what i'm getting here look new creative ideas new ventures a fresh start yes maybe for some of you you had this business idea you presented it many people were like uh, had different views they didn't approve or maybe there was a specific person because of this specific person there there was issues but finally this specific per person is leaving your life now like they are getting you the permission let's do it and then you have to take everything from scratch start again everything and yeah you're excited you're going to the unknown but it will lead to a lot of justice that's what i'm getting here look with this milk and honey yes the rainbows the worst part is over right the the part where you were feeling like giving up where you felt like there is a lot of conflicts i'll not be able to make it um uh, maybe there was a specific person because of this specific person you had a lot of issues but finally this person is leaving your life and the uh, the hard part is over now with this milk and honey there is a lot of abundance coming your way yes you're feeling very happy this is a new chapter of your life this is the new beginning where you don't know where you're going you don't have any plans you're like yes one by one i will take it take it take it and but it is going to give you a lot of abundance right you're rising you're rising you're finally feeling like yes maybe spirit protected maybe spirit was waiting for this person to leave so i can continue maybe if this person was there maybe there has been some issues that's why this was delayed so yeah it's like uh, spirit's rejection is uh, something for our protection right yeah so yeah that's what i'm getting here for you guys so this is going to be an amazing journey for you guys full of abundance look at the milk and honey there is going to be a lot for you guys uh, you will be learning a lot you will be learning a lot this is a new journey learning uh, understanding a lot of things gaining a lot of knowledge gaining a lot of wisdom doing things by yourself a lot of new ideas learning 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 a lot of this is a learning phase for you guys uh, but this will be beautiful that's what i'm getting here for group number 3 hope it made sense i will see you soon bye bye